Hi, I'm Bob Fowler. This is my wife, Marty. You're probably on your planning hour or between rehearsals right now, and we'd like to thank you for taking time to look at this preview DVD. I started out as a teacher with a degree in performance and very little experience in technical theater. While I was comfortable directing and teaching acting classes, I always felt like I was just one step ahead of my tech theater classes, and it took me years of trial and error to get up to speed on the tech end of my shows. Bob and I talked about what materials would improve instruction and make the lives of the classroom teachers and after-school sponsors simpler. Along with a former student of mine, we hit upon the idea of doing a series of tech theater DVDs that would appeal to today's visual learners. Our slogan has been, if we say it, we show it. We chose the DVD format because through the years, we wasted too much time in our classrooms searching through videotapes for the correct section. Included with the DVD is a CD-ROM of support materials like lesson designs with multiple strategies for different learning styles, resource sheets and assessments, along with scoring guides, writing assignments, and the alignments to the National Standards for Arts Education. Included is permission to copy all the support materials forever. And all of the materials are provided in PDF files that can be printed on either Mac or PC formats. The support materials are so complete. You can be out sick or go to a festival or conference and know that there is valuable instruction going on in your class. Most teachers have commented that they also use the DVDs to break in new students to their extracurricular programs. Program 1, Introduction to Technical Theater, takes your students on a field trip to working for Scenium, Arena, and Thrust Stages, and takes them on a backstage tour of a professional theater. We all know that even though the audience only sees the actors on stage, it's just as important to have talented technicians working behind the scenes. Theater hierarchy is illustrated by showing students performing their crew assignments and through interviews with working professionals. When we talk about stage managers, vocal coaches, board operators, electricians, and the many other members of the production team, we also show them doing their jobs. A section on the parts of the stage illustrates visually why stage right and stage left are reversed from the audience's point of view. This program is great for any theater class. Program two is basic set construction and theater safety. This program starts out discussing basic theater and tool safety. Once you're squared away with safety, it's time to start building sets. We look at common materials used in set construction and then take you step by step through the construction of platforms, stair units, wagons, and flats. Common joining techniques are demonstrated before the section on safely striking the set. Again, we constantly stress the safety aspects of working in a theater and working with tools, like this reminder to wear safety glasses. Program 3, Lighting for the Theater, first illustrates some of the reasons for using stage lighting and how we can control the different qualities of light. Next, your students compare and contrast the different types of lighting instruments, their uses, and how to focus, do cuts, use gobos, and bench focus. We differentiate the aspects of a basic light plot, the hanging plot, the instrument schedule, the patching schedule, and cue sheets. Then we walk the students through the process of hanging and focusing, patching, and cueing. Just like set construction, safety is stressed throughout this program. Program 4, Audio for Theater, is hosted by David Eisenhower, who started his pro audio career running sound for his high school theater productions. This program begins with a look at a day in David's life as a concert engineer touring the world with top name acts. The program differentiates the parts and functions of a sound system, microphone patterns, and how different mics are used for different jobs, an extensive section on wireless mics, setting up your system for each show, 
and a great section on troubleshooting your system that many teachers think alone is worth the price of the program. It doesn't matter if you have a state-of-the-art sound system or a very basic system. This program prepares your students to evaluate your equipment and decide how to get the most from it. Program 5, Stage Management, demonstrates all the aspects of being a top flight stage manager. This program is hosted by Tom Martin, who has stage managed at the professional level for nearly 30 years. Tom discusses tricks of the trade that only experience can teach. Your students will analyze how to run productive meetings and rehearsals. How to work with the director, actors, and crews by keeping open, clear lines of communication. How to effectively do the multitude of other jobs that fall to the stage manager, like taping the rehearsal space, putting together prompt books and calling scripts, and even how to handle conflict when it arises. Tom also illustrates in depth his system of script notation and how to call a show effectively. This stage management program is a must for the aspiring stage managers in your program. Program 6 analyzes set design and how to transform words in the script into a set on the stage. We differentiate between common types of interior and exterior set designs, box sets, unit sets, and multiple scene sets. We then probe script analysis to determine the technical demands, style, and production concept and how essential it is to work with the director and other designers to achieve a specific production concept. After investigating areas like sight lines, furniture placement, traffic patterns, and visual composition, we dissect the plans for an actual set and evaluate how all the pieces of the set work together using very basic scale drawings. Finally, the students finish up with a project in which they execute a set of drawings and scale model of a play. Written assessments and a grading rubric for the final project are included. Program 7, Lighting Design, is an extension of the Lighting for Theater program and should be used in conjunction with that program. It addresses basic concepts of lighting design and walks students through the process of designing lights for a production. The program then investigates the process of script analysis and the collaborative process that goes on with the director and other designers. A section on color theory is next, followed by a thorough exploration of angles of light and other design considerations. The next section of the program analyzes the hanging plot, instrument schedule, and patching schedule of two very different shows, with footage of the light cues from those shows and how to cue a show on both computerized and manual lighting controllers. A ground plan of an interior set, cue sheets, blank hanging plots, and all other necessary materials are included in the support materials. And the final project is to execute a complete light plot for a show with many special effects. Program 8, Business and House Management, will help you and your students organize your marketing efforts, assemble a winning house management team, and keep your show on budget. Even before the curtain goes up on opening night, your audience's first impressions of your production are your advertising, tickets, programs, and house crew. Business and house management steps off the stage into the business office, lobby, and box office to investigate the efforts that are necessary for successful performances, like choosing shows that will get not only your school, but your entire community involved. This program details working with tickets, programs, publicity, and helps your students to discover different ways to fund your shows and continue to build your theater program. Business and house management also demonstrates how to make your theater space, no matter how big or small, a welcome and safe environment to help keep your audiences coming back. 
Building your curricular tech theater program will also help your extracurricular program grow. Because a lot of students who would never consider acting find out firsthand that there is an important place for them behind the scenes. We'd now like to invite you to scroll through the menu and sample part of each PTT title for yourself. Again, thanks for taking time out of your busy schedule to preview our programs.